Welcome back to Let's Play Paladin's Quest. Sorry about my uh, voice volume being all over the map. I'm trying to find a consistent setup for my sound. Uh, anyway, I have loaded state. We are now both at level 17, uh, Tina and myself, because I'm Ray Chesney the Avatar, I guess. Yeah, no, they're both at level 17. They had been at, like, level 3, 4, something, 5, 6, whatever. And, um... I will follow you wherever you go. She's now maxed out all of her spirits. That took a while, actually. Um, did a lot of off-screen stuff there. And uh, Chesney, Ray Chesney the Avatar, has done the same thing. He only has two spirits. She has three. Um, although, she will never get the F spirit. And uh, he will eventually be able to cast every spell in the game. Although you note, if you look at her spells that she has... Heal up, anti-poison. She is, at least to start with, the generic, physically weak girl character who does curing magic. So don't worry, that stereotype is still alive and well. Oh, Midia, it's so good to have you back safe. Please see the Elder. I'm not the Elder, I'm just his doppelganger. Fritz would be pleased about doppelgangers. Oh, thank you, hero. Peace has now returned to Ratzerg. You must be tired. I know not where you are going, but please stay at my home tonight. You could ask where I'm going when tomorrow comes to talk again. Midi has left my party, but she said she was going to follow me forever. Like a man key from Pokemon. Once it starts shaking, it will follow you forever. Oh, hold on. She must have been sleeping on a table downstairs. I'm sorry to wake you up, but there's something I have to ask you. When I saw you in that cave, I had the feeling that fate was at work. I want to come with you. I want to share my destiny with you. I know it's not logical, but it's how I feel. Please, I'll follow you anywhere. Take me with you. Um, no. <laughs> you are kind. You probably think that if I were to leave, the Elder would be sad. But please, I'll go anywhere with you. Please, I'm with you. No. You are kind. No, not kind. I'm mean. Thank you, thank you. Now let's leave here before the household wakes up. Video has joined your party. Very well, Tina. You can come along. Come along with me. Ray the Avatar. Uh, by the way, did you know that I unleashed a horrible monster that destroyed the entire city? Sniff, sniff, Midia, be careful. Aww. It's nice, the little guy who isn't the elder but looks exactly like him also likes Midia. Ah, looks like I'm not getting out of here alive. Midia, were you thinking of just leaving without saying anything to me? No, Midia, I have no intention of holding you back. If you intend to go, then go. When you came to this world as a baby 13 years ago, I became resigned to the fact that this day would come. Master Chesney, take good care of her. I have heard from your schoolmaster that you were the cause of this disaster. That is why I trust you implicitly not to get her killed. I also know the objective of your journey. Go through the western forest to Jurian. The great spiritualist Daphne lives in Jurian. Ask her for help. She should help you. If Daphne cannot help you, ask for help from Fred or, you know, Shaggy or Velma. Me, my wife and I were always felt as if you were our daughter. This is the crown with which you came to Ratzirk. Take it with you. Was that person that looks exactly like him... Um, his wife? Chesney and Midia were greeted on their journey by Soa's Daylight. Oh, that's nice. If you wish, you may come back anytime. This is your home. Yeah, I'd like to come back now. This, uh, Ray the Avatar is kind of a jerk, actually. Oh, Master Chesney, please take good care of Midia. She's like a daughter to me because I'm a woman, apparently. You know, not that men can't have daughters. I don't know what I'm talking about now. Oh, there's three people hanging around here now. It's... Wow. The Elder is always worrying about Miss Midia. Let's equip Midia with that um... Sufkrun or whatever it's called. This is actually Sophia's... Sophia's crown, I think. Maybe it's Sophie. I don't know. Um... These... These items will be important later in the game. How the heck do I have all those para knives? They must, enemies must be dropping them or something. Anyways, uh, so, alright. You can have four characters in your party because you end up hiring mercenaries and stuff. But these are the only two characters that you'll have for the whole game, which means that I'm now free to do any power leveling I think is necessary. Uh, but I've already done that power leveling, so forget about it. Sophia's crown. I think the Sophia items that you collect throughout the game, they open, like, weird door... Eh, I don't want to spoil anything, but it gets... 
they open these um, these doors that have like weird holes under them are opened by the Sophie items so I'm thinking like I can at least try it I don't think it's gonna let me in here at this point in the game oh Okay, I'm thinking, yeah, it's weird. You use them to unlock doors, but, um... And I think you really do use that item on that door. It's just, you're not supposed to be doing it yet, so it's just not going to make it work. I'm not going to bother to explain why it doesn't work. It just won't work. And maybe it's not that. Maybe it's a different item. I don't know. Whatever. Okay. Uh, I should probably sell all those para knives that I've been picking up, but, you know, who cares? I've got more money than I'm supposed to have at this point, too, I think, just from all the fighting. Kong and Hedgehog. Kongs are freaking deadly early in the game, but um, I'm already, like, over-leveled, so... Those hedgehogs really should have taken... I see one hit point damage to Midia, who is, like, the adorable little weak girl from this thing. Yeah. You need to, like, part your hair so you can see or something, buddy. And there, like, Ray the Avatar, Ray Chaz and the Avatar is leveled up anyway, so. Alright, here we are on, like, I don't know, Planet Namek, I guess, with the trees. Pack Rat, you guys are not really worth my time. Uh, guys, seriously, why are you... <laughs> they prevented me from running away, and then one of them ran away. Nice. Should have taken a tip from your buddy there, buddy. Okay, so that's a waste of time. But the uh, random enemy encounters don't seem to be as f frustratingly frequent as they were in um, Kongs. In um, Tecmo Secret of the Stars. And the Kongs did not attempt to prevent my escape. Or if they did attempt to prevent my escape, they didn't succeed. La -da 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 -la -da -da. It's Ray Chesney, and he is the Avatar. Ray is the avatar. He's got a little girlfriend. She's Tina Medea. She's Tila Tequila. That's right. Tila Tequila is the little girl who's going to save the world with sluttiness. <laughs> She's going to distract the horrible ancient weapon Dalgran with her bazoom. Let's talk to this guy. You seem to have gotten lost in the forest. It's been a long time since I've seen anyone. You can sleep here tonight. What about that woman over to the left? Okay, he's just not paying attention, I guess. Good morning, you two. You slept soundly if you're tired, rest some more. Please move so I can steal your things. Hey, I've obtained a fire cud. Fire cud is chewed by fire cows. And a pro ball. I can play in the World Cup. The uh, fire... Well, hold on. I can save your progress up to now. Shall I save it? No. Come again? No. Save states, baby. Um, the different spirit... I guess they're cards. Increase your uh, magical affinity. But um, I've already leveled this fire up all the way. So I can't really get any higher. I'll hold on to it in case somebody else can use it. This is interesting. Um... A bunch of interconnected kites? This is a screw mobile camp. Screw you camp. Welcome to camp. Screw you. Birds are weak to the spell of fire. I know that. <laughs> I knew it. I have faith. My religion teaches me that birds are weak to the spell of fire. If you do not believe so, you are a heretic and I will kill you. Kill you. Free, free. With the perp bird gone, we have nothing to do. The perp bird... The perp bird was like a, a perpetrator bird. Probably meant to be purple bird, but up for the idea that it's the perp bird. So you can get a bunch of cops together to go chasing after a perp bird. Travelers, if there is something you want, let us sell it to you. <laughs> I wonder if he has anything good. Not really. Uh, that medicine thing reminds me. I'm going to have to explain the mini bulls at some point, but not right now, because now it's time to end this video. When we come back, we will explore the Screw You mobile camp. So, screw you.